Have you heard of Trade Coffee? Basically, it's an online subscription. When you run out of coffee, it sends you more. And it's different types of coffee, so you're not getting the same one that you've been drinking that week before. And the great thing about this, it's you're helping out small businesses. So it is the roasters themselves actually roasting the coffee, sending it to you. And the great thing about this, it's helping a lot of roasters around the whole country. So it's not just from your state or people around you. Um, I'm going to basically do a little unboxing and tell you guys why you guys should buy it. So the coffee just arrived. This is what it looks like. It came in like this little bag and then it obviously has the address, but I'm not going to show you. Um, it smells really good just from the packaging. I bet you the lady was just sniffing it all this way from like the um, UPS store. So it does smell really good. I've been sniffing it since I got it from the mail. So it comes with the coffee, obviously, and then it also comes with this like booklet. Okay, well, basically it just tells you what you ordered, like if you can't read it, I guess. So I just opened it. Ooh. It kind of smells exactly like the Starbucks one, which I'm kind of like, uh, okay. So this, that's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. I got the whole bean roast. And this is what the beans look like. Now these beans aren't as brown as the ones from Starbucks. The so ones from Starbucks are a little bit darker. These are a little bit lighter, even though this is a dark roast. So I just grind it up and now I'm brewing it as you guys can see. So this is the mug I'm going to be using because everything that it says on it is true. So first we're going to try it black and... I can already tell you that um, when I brewed it, now that it's been brewed, it doesn't smell um, like it has a lot of flavor. It smells like basic, I don't know, hotel coffee, which uh, it's not that exciting, especially if it, because this was $14, but with the coupon. Um, I used honey and it gave me, um, so I used honey um, to give me coupons and it went down from $14 to $8, which is um, a really good deal. It doesn't really smell like anything. It doesn't really taste like, it tastes like basic like diner coffee. So let me add some milk. So in my coffee, I put half and half because it has a better flavor than milk and it's more rich. So I added the milk already. So here's the thing, it doesn't, it just tastes like coffee, like I don't, it, it doesn't have, I don't know, it's just not special, it just tastes exactly like coffee, it's not as strong as Starbucks one, I don't know, it's just basic. I know a lot of you guys are going to be wondering, you know, what were my initial thoughts about this coffee, so it wasn't strong, it wasn't light, it wasn't, you know, um, acidic, it wasn't flat, it was just basic coffee, like if I were to go to Walmart and pick out, you know, the big tub of um, coffee for like $3, I've been sitting there for like 6 months. So overall, it's not, it wasn't my favorite, it would probably work better as an, ice co as an iced coffee, as I said, or maybe for someone who likes coffee but doesn't really drink it that often and they just want to like have um, a better experience. Um, so one thing that I do like about this is that you can choose um, what type of coffee you're into that week, whether it's, you know, one drink of black that uh, week and then next week with milk. So one thing that would change about this website is if you could look up a coffee and you could write a review on that specific type of coffee, uh, reviews and you're like oh um this person said it was strong but recommends drinking it black because um it's not that acidic um you could get more of idea of what it of what the coffee actually tastes like and not you know just by reading dark roast anyway you guys that's all i have for you guys today i hope you guys like comment and subscribe and i hope you guys remember that trade coffee is supporting small businesses so you guys should definitely um support smaller businesses and remember to like comment and subscribe